Hello and ordinary and beautiful. Welcome again to my channel for those of you who are new. Hello, my name is Lina and uh, pretty much this is my channel and I talk about things that I like. Mostly, mostly about movies, but sometimes I love to talk about shopping, makeup, books. Books uh, very ra rarely, but today I'm going to talk about my latest shopping editions. Let's start with skincare. Skincare is the most important thing about me. I have noticed that no matter what makeup I uh, put on my face, the skincare comes first because if I don't have a good skin, the makeup won't look good too. So I bought myself two Garnier products. The first one is their micellar water. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit late with my purchases, but anyway, the Garnier micellar cleansing water. I buy this over and over and over again. I I use it whenever I come back home from a very, very late party with friends, you know, going to a club or something, and I'm too tired to go through my whole routine of cleansing my face. So I remove my makeup with my makeup remover, and then I use this, and it's wonderful. I absolutely love it. It's perfect. I also use it as a toner. I use the micellar cleansing water from their, their series Pure Active, also wonderful. This is great. I don't want to buy some expensive micellar water now. I This one is perfect, it's cheap, it's good, it's wonderful. Another thing from Garnier is the Pure Active Purifying Cleansing Gel. Everything from the Pure Active series by Garnier is wonderful. I have used the washing gel, the toner, the... what else? the micellar water. This gel I used to use it uh, a few years back. I can't remember when, but I was very happy I had it. And for me it's perfect because although I am out of teenage years, I still have breakouts and sometimes and I I just can't wait to try it again. It's it's that kind of product that I hope it's good again because a few years back, as I mentioned, it was wonderful. I hope it's wonderful still. Uh, something else. I went to see my niece in Sofia, which is the capital city of Bulgaria. And while I was there, my sister and her husband, uh, they took me to one of the big uh, shopping centers. and. I was able to visit the Lush Cosmetics store and I bought myself this Cynthia Sylvia Stout Beer Shampoo. This one has beer. I think I also I think it also has let me check. Stout cognac cognac oh scotch and lemons make this a supremely conditioning shampoo to give weight and shine. I have tried this once, no twice already uh, and I, I was impressed by the way the only worry I had was that this was going to smell pretty much like an alcohol on my hair after I wash it and blow it out nothing like that it was wonderful it was beautiful I uh, for, this is what I can say for now it's supposed to make my hair uh, shinier and not so greasy because uh, my my everyday routine is quite, uh, how, uh, how to say it, quite busy. I always run my fingers through my hair and because of that. But uh, I hope uh, I hope this one is good. I'm going to try it a little bit more. Something else I got from Sofia was from Wycon Cosmetics. Uh, this is their long-lasting liquid lipstick. So this long lasting lipstick is hydrating and it also it's a matte one. The moment you apply it on your lips, it becomes matte. I mean, I was so impressed. Just let me swatch it a little bit for you guys. It's beautiful. I love it. I absolutely love this color. And another thing I got from Wycon Cosmetics was this red uh, lip liner. You see? I mean, it's a little bit orange red, but I have. Uh, I think I'm going to make it work somehow. 
So this is for makeup and skincare. I know it's not much, but after all, I went there to see my niece because she had a birthday. And besides, I wanted to try Wycon Cosmetics for, for some months. So I can't wait to make a review about these two things. You know, guys, I am so excited, especially for this one. Oh, I love this lip color. It's, it's beautiful, 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 beautiful. I'll try it. Next week, we'll be testing this one. And of course, because I don't care only about makeup and skincare and hair care and movies, I love to read. Can you see? I think you can guess the book. It's the business on high heels. So it's uh, by Tamar Tamara Mellon and William Patrick. So Tamara Mellon is obviously the founder of the shoe empire Jimmy Choo. Oh, I'd love to try these shoes one day. If I am lucky, one day I'm going to buy myself a pair of Jimmy Choo's. And I saw the book and I said, oh, what I'm going to buy. I, By the way, I was in such a, a crossroad, let's say it. I wanted to buy this one, but I also wanted to buy the Danish girl and I also wanted to buy the new biography book about Coco Chanel but I was like no I need to read this book this woman uh, was fired by Vogue and she has started from scratch you know and now she's worldwide famous and she has this amazing company and it's, it's inspiring and I can't wait to read it guys I mean boy how I can I I mean boy oh I'm excited I'm beyond excited to read this book seriously so I guess these were my purchases for the last month for February by the way yes I don't shop that much after all my life is busy my schedule is is absolutely full. I have, I don't know how I manage my time, but I'm still trying. And if you have enjoyed this video, remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always guys, remember to keep on smiling because obviously life is way too short to frown. Bye guys!